Welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking. Today what I'm going to show you is one of my favorite recipes, so let's get started. Welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking, and this is dinner for two. This is my stuffed Cubanella peppers with chicken and cheese, so let's get started. In my bowl I have two cups of cooked chicken that I diced, one celery stalk that I diced, a fourth of a cup of diced banana peppers, give it a little heat, you can see the banana peppers, I mixed it all together, then I added a tablespoon of Italian seasoning and then salt and pepper. I have one cup of cooked rice. I'll add that in. So all the ingredients in this bowl is two cups of diced cooked chicken, one cup of cooked rice, one tablespoon of Italian seasoning, salt and pepper, one celery stalk diced, and a fourth of a cup of diced banana peppers. Now I have two Cubanella peppers. I clean them out. So now I'll stuff them with this chicken. This is really good. So I have it all stuffed. I'll place it back in my casserole dish. And I like to overstuff it. Just put a little extra in there. There's the second half of the first pepper. So I had this leftover chicken and I didn't know what to do with it. So I figured, well, let me try this. I made this once before and it was really good. Last one. Making sure to fill in everywhere. And as I'm filling it, I'm pressing down with the spoon to let it stick in there. That's perfect. Place that in my casserole dish. So I have enough left over for one more Cubanella pepper. But this is going to be dinner for two, so I'm just using the two here. I'll salt and pepper. I have my oven on 350. And I'll bake these in my oven for about 30 minutes or until the pepper is nice and tender. So now for the cheese. I have 8 ounces of Fiesta Blend cheese. And Fiesta Blend cheese is Monterey Jack and Cheddar. So I'll sprinkle some on top. The more cheese the better. So I probably won't quite use the full 8 ounces. So 
So I have very little left over of the eight ounces. Now for my sauce, I'll use one quart of my homemade tomato sauce. I'll open it up. Now doesn't that look good? And you know what? I'll sprinkle the rest of the cheese that I had left over. Just sprinkle it on top. How's that? The more cheese, the better. Now I'll take some aluminum foil and put that on top. So I'll put the aluminum foil on top. this in your 350 degree oven for about 30 minutes or until the pepper is nice and tender. So into the oven it goes. Now I'll check on my stuffed cubanella peppers with chicken and cheese. It smells really good in the house here. I'll take the foil off. Oh yeah, look at how good that looks. I'll take it out of the oven. This smells really, really good. So now that I placed the stuffed cubanella peppers with chicken and cheese on top of my stove, this is my dinner for two. So my husband and I will be having stuffed cubanella peppers with leftover chicken and cheese. I can't wait to dig in. Enjoy. Well, thanks so much for tuning in to Cheryl's Home Cooking and watching my stuffed cubanella peppers with chicken and cheese. And this is dinner for two. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next video. Bye-bye. Well, thanks so much for tuning in to another episode of Cheryl's Home Cooking. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next video. Bye-bye.